This video is about one of the most important mindsets I learned that allowed me to start and build a successful online business. And what this mindset is about is people's understanding of patience. And I think that most people have a very flawed and incorrect understanding of when to be patient and when to be impatient because I too used to have the wrong understanding about patience. So the way most people in life and in business look at patience surrounding the starting and building of their business is that they're extremely patient before they start the business. They wait years until their school is complete, until they have enough money saved up, until their personal life is sorted out, until their dog is finished, puppy training, whatever it is. People wait until the stars are aligned to start their business. And they are so patient up until this point. And then when they start the business, they're extremely impatient. They will often go six months and the business won't be financially successful enough yet, or it won't be at the level of profitability to completely replace their job income at their previous position. And then they feel frustrated, they feel angry, and they often quit and go back to working a job. So they're extremely impatient after they start the business. And when I started to think about this, I realized just how backwards this equation is. What successful entrepreneurs do is the exact opposite. Successful business people and successful entrepreneurs are extremely impatient before they start their business. The period of time between the point in which they decide, hey, I'm gonna be an entrepreneur, and then when they actually start their business and start making moves for their business is very small. And then once they start their business, they're extremely, they're extremely patient and they expect it to take a long time to build. And when I adopted this strategy, it resulted in me quickly quitting my job and starting North Digital. For me, the amount of time from the moment I decided I wanted to be an entrepreneur to the moment I quit my stable nine to five job and started North Digital was about six months. So that's pretty good. I didn't, I was not patient there. I was very impatient. And now that I started North Digital, it's been almost four years now, I've been patient throughout that process and I didn't expect it to be successful right away. And for that reason, because I've stuck with it, it has allowed the business to actually grow and be successful. So if you are someone who wants to be an entrepreneur and has not yet started your business, screw patience. You need to be impatient and you need to start as soon as possible because the harsh reality is that the longer you wait and the longer you hold the intention of being a successful entrepreneur without acting on it, the less likely it is you will ever start the business. And the vast majority of people who want to be entrepreneurs never actually pull the trigger and start. They live their whole lives working a job that they don't really like. So don't let that be you. If you haven't started, start now, start tomorrow, start very soon, either on a full-time or part-time basis. And for the people who have started, for the people who have paying clients, for the people who are making the cold calls, for the people who are actually generating revenue and taking actions for their business and they've started, then be patient. It's okay to be patient once you've started. It's okay to wait multiple years before you're extremely successful. Now, of course, it's possible that if you get the right mentor, if you follow the right proven process, you can achieve great financial success in six to 12 months. That's very possible and many people do that. But if that's not the case for whatever reason for you and it takes you two, three or four years to reach financial success and entrepreneurship, that's totally okay. And in the if you look at your life and your career, let's say your career is gonna be between 40 to 60 years long. If it takes you four years to become a successful entrepreneur versus six months, in the scheme of things, that doesn't make that big of a difference. The important thing is you don't give up and go back to your job. And the reason why this is so important is that people often talk about you should be patient or you should not be patient. And both of those are right at times and are incorrect at times. The thing about applying patience to your entrepreneurship journey 
is that there are certain times where patience will serve you and there are certain times where impatience will serve you. So that's what I want to get across in this video. And if you, if you look at biographies and teachings from successful entrepreneurs, so many of them talk about how the overnight success was actually 10 years of work in the making. Uh, people often use the analogy of the Chinese bamboo plant as being a being analogous to starting a business. So when you plant a Chinese bamboo plant for the first four years, you don't see visible growth above the dirt. You plant the seeds, you water it, you give it enough sunlight, whatever, and the thing doesn't visibly grow. And then in year five, the thing can grow up to 80 feet in a number of months. So there's no visible progress for years, and then all of a sudden it takes off. And that's similar for a business. Sometimes when you're trying to be an entrepreneur, the first couple of years are not gonna be as much visible progress as you want to see. In my case, it was that. My, my first year of business was building a website design company that ultimately didn't work and I ultimately had to change my business model. But it doesn't really matter. The fact it took me a few years to be financially successful in business versus someone else who took six months, the important thing is that I didn't give up and go back to a job. So I hope this video sheds some light on this whole idea of patience and what you need to do depending on in what depending on what group you're in. So again, group A, if you haven't started your business, start now, be impatient. Group B, if you've already started, just chill and keep putting in the work and it's gonna pay off. And that's all I got for this video, guys. So if you like this content, please comment, like, let me know what you wanna see in future content. And until next time, I will see you guys later.